Hey guys, welcome to For Tutorials. Guys, today I teach you how to create really cool 3D logo animation in After Effect. So firstly guys, I create new composition and guys presets, use full HD frame and duration only take 10 seconds and press OK. After that guys, I go on project, right click import and import file. Guys, select your logo and I choose Instagram logo and import select drag and drop in main com right and select this logo right click i take pre com and guys type only logo and move all attribute check press ok that's it and now guys i go on effect and presets and type vegas select and apply on logo layer yeah great and I go to image control and channel guys I take alpha this one and segments I take only one right guys go on blend mode this one and take transparent yes guys change also color I take white wait and I create animation so go on length length check on zero frame and length I take 0 and I go to 3 second and length I take 1 go on back and play yeah great and now guys change this rotation animation go on rotation I take 180 degree and breadth size increase like 40 yes great and hardness increase take like one and midpoint opacity I take one and midpoint position take one yes go on back and play right guys this is my simple stroke animation yeah and after that guys select this logo and press duplicate you can go to edit and duplicate Yes, and I go to like 0 0.15 frame, go to 0 0.15, right? Guys, go on again, effect and presets and type tint, select this tint and apply on effect control. Yes, go on back and play. Guys, change some settings like this is my channel alpha and I take volume. Yes, and threshold I take like randomly 230 and guys rotation change like 90 and red size I take only 10 go on back and play see guys right it's so easy okay now so stop Guys, I go to main com, right click, new and take solid layer and layer name take white solid and color take same white and press OK. Guys, select this white solid layer. I create masking. So I take circle, take ellipse tool and guys press control and shift key and drag and drop. Yes create circle and guys select this white solid layer and I go to starting point take three second three second and create some small animation I go to eight frame 80 second and mask and mask path check right and I go to three second three and guys double click and make smaller zoom yeah that's it so fit to 100 percent and play right this is my masking and now guys select both keys and right click take easy in 
actually easy is yeah the shortcut command is f9 and now guys again i go to effect and preset type turbulence displacer select and apply on white solid layer and i create animation so same go on three second and amount check and amount i take one and guys i go to eight second eight and amount i take 100 percent and enter guys complexity i take randomly take two right go on back and play yeah nice okay guys you can apply one more turbulence so select and apply but change complexity like 5 and play yeah this animation is better for me okay and now guys select all layers and right click I take pre-com and type logo mask and press ok guys go on project select this logo drag and drop in main comp and select this logo mask and guys change mode I take this one stand like alpha so go on back and play Yes, see guys, this my stroke animation. Yeah, great. Okay. So after that guys, select again both layers and right click and I take pre-com. Guys, this time you can take like logo 3D. 3D and press ok and guys I apply background texture so go on project right click import and import file guys see that this is my texture guys you can download my texture and logo and my project file from download my website link in description select and import guys change little bit color correction Go on effect and preset and type curve, select and apply. Little bit increase brightness and darkness. Yeah, right. So guys, now both layers should be on 3D, right? And select this logo 3D layer and press P, P for position. Actually guys, select this one press p and this position go on like 50 right i show you go on for view yeah see guys this is my insta logo and this is my texture go on view one and now guys i create camera animation so so select and main comp right click and new and i take camera and presets i take 50 mm press ok go on zero frame and guys i take unified camera tool and camera transform point of interest check position check and guys position go on change like this right and go to 9 second and position change like this right and now select keyframes and right click take easy in this one also yes so guys this is my final camera animation and play
yeah great right guys and after that guys i apply light so right click new and i take light this one and guys light type take point and change color and color i take like orange the color code is 25 100 and 100 and press ok guys intensity take 300 and radius i take 500 and car shadow check press ok so guys change viewport i take four view press and light should be on go on corner and up yes and guys select this light and create duplicate control d and change position guys change also color light double click on this light and color i take blue and press ok and little bit closer yes right and guys select this light too and again copy and double click i take light gray and guys go on on top yes and little bit back yeah and guys last one copy and go on down yes see guys i apply four lights go on back and play see guys this is my final lighting and lastly guys i create depth on this logo so i show you how to create depth so stop and guys select this 3d logo right select 3d logo and press duplicate ctrl d select this logo and press p p for position and position take only two and i go to guys effect and preset type bevel alpha select this bevel alpha apply on top 3d layer and change guys light angle take like minus 35 randomly and light intensity take 0 0.70 yes and guys select this 3d layer and again duplicate ctrl d and press p p for position and position this time i take 5 and guys go on again effect and preset and type ramp select this gradient ramp apply on third layer and guys go on top gradient ramp and change only start color and end color start color light gray and color i take dark gray yes right guys so go on back and play okay so stop after that guys select this third top layer and create duplicate more like 20 times so select all 3d layer and press p p for position and change only this last position like 5 and this time take 10 15 and take 20 this man like 25 30 and guys this is 30 35 and 40 45 and 50 right guys so change view angle yes guys you can delete this extra layers like this one delete 
and delete yeah guys i take only layer 17 times right and unfold all right and one view guys see this is my final logo animation fit to 100 percent and you can change this resolution yeah great see guys now this is looking really 3d okay guys you can increase the shadow so effect and preset type drop shadow select apply on top layer yes and drop shadow distance like 5 is good opacity softness take 10 opacity i take like 70 yeah that's better see guys this is my final logo animation right so guys my final logo animation is finished so if you like my video please share and subscribe my youtube channel thank you